Hey, it's Lady Bourgeois and it's Boxy Charm. Yes, I already did Boxy Charm opening for February 2018. Now we're going to try it out. I'm going to try it out with you guys and see what we get as we go along. There's a lot of holographic, shiny, sparkly, I don't know, so sparkly, but I don't know. Valentine's Day is coming, so let's go have fun with this. My eyebrows are ready. My eyes are prepped with a little bit of concealer and translucent powder. I think we're going to go in with the 35B palette. Now, we're going to see where it goes. We got to do eyes, and I really want to incorporate those highlighters not only into the face, but into the eyes as well. Forgive me, I'm sick today, but I wanted to get this up for you guys. So, all right, we're going to go in with this pink right here. So tap it off. Ooh, I'm feeling that coffee. And we're just going to put it right in there and blend it. I think we're going to go for the next color because I'm liking it. It's going to be that right there. We're gonna go in now with this beautiful blue right here. I'm keeping it towards the outer third, outer half. I like it. Now we're going to take an M506, Morphe M506, and we're going to get in to this blue right there. She's calling me. Okay, next we're going to stay with that 506, and we're going to get into this deep purple. Now, the last thing we're going to do before we dip into the boxy is we're going to take a little bit of the first two pinks on your 506, tap it off, and you're actually going to use this on your lid very lightly. Just in the inner corner and brush it across, kind of blending. Okay, you guys, it is time for the Naked Cosmetics Highlighters. I don't want to use them just on my face. I want to use them on the eyes as well. And look at these six beautiful colors. I really want to start with this pink color in the middle. And I want to try to get a couple of these in. So I don't know. Let's try it first without setting spray. All right, going in. Ooh. Let's see. I don't know. I'm going to spray a little bit of setting spray onto the back of my hand. In fact, I will use the Cover Effects Sparkly Spray since it's BoxyCharm. And now let's go back in with that top middle one, the purpley pink. Ooh! Yes! Yes! Yes, definitely. And let's just pack that on in the inner corner. Ooh. Ooh, she is so pretty. Okay, now I'm going to go for this beautiful blue color. I'm gonna switch brushes. It's just a flat Makeup Geek um, foiled eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna hit it with some setting spray. Ooh, let's see what happens. Right towards the center. And now, because I wanna use as many colors as possible, because I love this, we're gonna take this yellow and go for our inner corner. All right, now just because I'm having as much fun as possible with this palette and we've used the pink, we've used the blue, we've used the yellow, and I think I'm gonna use this peachy color as my highlight for my brow. So we'll dip into that peachy pink. I don't know, it's hard to tell. 
so let's get ooh. now I went in dry I don't know if I want to be glaring why not I mean look at my eye go for the setting spray yes there we go definitely oh, I really want to try that other color all right you know what for the hell of it we're gonna go for this color too we're gonna do this towards the front and we're just gonna put a little bit of this one towards the back because I want to try it. I think that makes all of them but the green because I've just got to and that looks like it has a little bit of a blue reflect let's see Ooh, it does! Yes! I'm gonna bring this a little forward. Oh! Oh! Yes! Yes! I'm so glad! Oh, this definitely. So we've gotten everything in but the green. But we will get her in it. Um, now that I've cleaned up under my eyes, so we're gonna go back in with the Morphe 35B. I was thinking of going in with some green under the eye, but I'm a huge fan of green maybe we will maybe we'll do a little bit Urgh. go for it we'll go in lightly with some green let's go for it with a light hand just in the outer corner and we will tie in the blue oh okay i kind of like it See, I always try to try new things over and over again, even if I don't like it, same thing. Same thing with food. Ooh, I'm liking that. All right, and then we're gonna connect that up with some of that dark blue from over here, just to tie it in and bring it under. I'm also gonna go in with a little bit of the pink that we used, the first two pinks, just a little bit. If you haven't figured it out i found a way to finally use a touch of that green the last color so just a little bit in the inner corner Ooh. and now it's time for the cover effects which i got the cover effects shimmer veil i believe it's in amethyst and i'm gonna get mine out oh she is pretty and i am definitely going to put a bit of her on my eye to finish i think we're going to tap a little in here and see how that works right in the center Ooh, ooh, okay okay i see you Ooh, oh yes i see you all right we're gonna go for a little more little bit more right in the center kind of touching the blue and the pink just to pop it up and then pat it out Ooh, she's going up a little bit that's okay hell she's pretty enough she can do hell she wants all right so far i am loving this we're gonna go in with the vintage black pencil at least that's what i got I don't even know what the options are. I'm assuming you all got the highlighter. I don't know if we got different colors of the um, cover effects. Anyway, I'm gonna try this out. Let's just try, supposedly it's precision and we're being smoked out. It's okay, I don't know. Do I wanna put it on my upper lid? It's kind of working out. I mean, it's all right. It's got a certain amount of control. I want to use a brush to pull it out. Sorry, Jessica, whatever. It's, it's all right, but it's not like precision, precision. I'm going to smoke that out a little bit. I'm not mad at it. But I need more eyeliner. All right, let me get some other eyeliner and lashes and mascara. All right, I've got the lashes on. I went for a little bit of drama. And we've got to 
finish up our face. Now, I'm not a big person who wears foundation a lot. I will be doing it more often, but I'm not gonna do it today. So if you wanna put your foundation on, go for it. I did a little spot concealing, um, a little bit on the chin, a little bit over here, and a little bit up here. If you look really closely, you can see I have little teeny marks all up here in these lines, because I was in an explosion. Yeah, literally, my oven exploded, and I was burned very badly. Um, I don't know if you can see it down here and here, but I was very lucky how I healed, but I do have some scars, and, um, I'm kind of picky about foundations and the way that it looks um, settling into the little scars. And even in person, nobody notices it, so it's a thing that I notice. So we've got the brushes left for contouring. I will contour. Give me the little brush. See these, I feel them. I'm not feeling I'm going to get a good contour out of this. All right, let's go in to my chocolate soleil. See, look, I tapped it off and it's like almost nothing there. All right, we'll go for nose. Now see, this is how I do my nose. You do this and make a straight line. See, I have a little bump and then my nose turns up. That's the easiest way to make a straight line, but I will do a contouring video. All right. It worked, it was cool. Do, do, do. Still, I have a favorite contouring brush, but all right, she did her job. And then we'll just blend that out. And I like to pull it up to here. All right, we'll go to the next size up the medium brush. Mm, it's not really, it doesn't hang onto the product amazingly well. I don't know, I'm not used to having to like really Dig in. I can do it with my left hand too. Certain things I can't do with my right hand, like shoot, pull. I can only do it lefty. I guess we'll do a little bit there. A little temple. I guess we can try out the big boy for that one. Big boy, big girl. I don't know. And I don't know. It's all right, it's all right. So far out of the three, I like this little one the best. Okay, moving on. Okay, let's get into highlighter. Where'd the highlighter go? Oh, hi. I said, I like, hi, Minnie Mouse. Holy crap. What do we use? Okay, it's obvious that I have to use the pink and the blue, and I'm gonna throw some green in to tie the green in from under my eye, which wait, I did put that there. So let's go in dry and see what this brush does dry, although it's not a highlight brush. Woo! Woo, she handled this though. Holy, wow. Is that or it's the highlighter? I don't know. We're going to try my highlighting brush on the other side. Holy hell. Ooh, all right. We tried this brush, which, you know, it could be a highlighting brush. Now, this is my favorite. Sephora 204, it's exactly like the double sided Kat Von D. She is clean. We're going to go into the pink on the other side. Bum. Turn and ready. Woo! No, it is the highlighter. This highlighter. Ooh. You know, I was gonna say yes um, when I filmed yesterday. Um, I believe this palette goes for um, $39.99. Yeah, and it's really small. The um, Kat Von D that's got five, the Alchemist palette went for 32 and I know the moon child one went for 40 which you can see is much bigger with this has much bigger pans so and very similar colors so far oh let's dip into this color that orangey with the um kind of bluish reflect put it underneath Ooh. it's not picking up
this brush sucks. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I suck like a child. We're going with tried and true. My trusty girl. She is up for any, ah, there we go. Ooh, wait, this color does not want to come out. It doesn't like setting spray. Oh, no. We're gonna go into the yellow and try to hit it for the top right here. Ooh, look at that. Oh, oh yeah. There's something about this mine that's, it's just not picking up. It picked up with my other brushes. I mean, it went on my eye, great. I'm gonna set the pitch of my voice. Take it down, girl, take it down. That yellow, even without setting spray up on the very top of the cheekbone. Ooh, yeah, ooh, I wanna see some of that on my nose. All right, let's try that orangey with the blue reflect. I'm like a flipping disco ball, yeah. You're gonna see this girl from space. Look out your windows. You're gonna be able to see me. Look towards New York, wherever you are. Look towards, you know, New York, New Jersey. That glow is me. Ooh, see, there's the orangey with the blue reflect. Oh, ooh, look at that yellow with the pink. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, a little bit of green. Just a little bit of green. Where are we gonna put that? Little, 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 right here. Ooh! Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, yes. All right, I gotta get into a little of the blue. This is so flippin' pretty. These are good. I was gonna use this cloud lip thing that we got a couple months back. I got this dark shade. Or I was going to use the Be Legendary, it's that liquid lip gloss, the vinyl lip. I love the vinyl. Foiled Brat. It is so pretty. Let's see with this eye. Ooh. What about putting the cover effects on here? Maybe. I don't know. I see it happen. I'm gonna put this on my the cover effects. I'm gonna take a little bit with my finger. All right, let's put some highlighter on. Oh, 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 hi. Hi there. Oh, that's that orange with the blue reflex. Let's get a little blue. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm happy now. Okay, and that is all she wrote. I have tried everything in the February Boxy Charm box. I have used the highlighter on my eyes, my cheeks, my lips, and I used all six colors. This is the final look. I like it. I am very happy. I'm a happy Valentine. I am in love with the highlighters. I also love the Cover FX uh, product that we got, the Shimmer Veil, awesome. The crown brushes, okay, honestly, meh. As I said, the lip scrub, I have not tried. I totally forgot. And the eyeliner, it's a black eyeliner. It's nothing special, nothing to write home about. I would say my two top favorite eyeliner pencils are the Make It Forever Aqua XL and the Mark Beauty um, highlighter. I'd say this box was worth it for the highlighter and the veil. Can you see my face? January's box, still not here. That's some pretty shady, shady, shady shite. You know, that's not cool, Boxy. It was lost by FedEx, and FedEx is reimbursing them. I'm gonna go prance around looking this way now because I wanna be seen from space, baby, space. Okay, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. 
have a wonderful day love you all lady borgia bye bye